это все, что осталось. This is what remained of Viktor Pavlyuk's house, his house and workshop in Shirokina. Ukrainian artist Viktor Pavlyuk became known for his excellent portraits in landscapes made in linocut techniques. He died in 2007, and his relatives preserved his works carefully, but then the war occurred. Several years ago, people left the war-torn village of Shirok and is seeking a safe haven. They took with them only bare essentials and had to leave these unique paintings behind. These paintings were considered lost for over five years. As far as I can understand, the family left in a hurry and couldn't return. Here you can clearly see the damage from bullets and the holes. Some of the paintings look as if they were cut by someone. By a twist of fate, the paintings were saved by a soldier with the call sign Picasso, a serviceman from Western Ukraine who was also an artist. In total, he evacuated over 300 works. Some of them were found right on the street, while others in Pavlyuk's workshop. Charles also hid his house, and paintings were all over the street. He saw them lying around and got them off the ground. He collected those paintings because he thought they had artistic value, so he amassed a collection. During fierce battles, the soldiers kept the canvases in a basement. As soon as it was possible, they brought them to Mariupol and asked the Tu art platform to store them. I can imagine how valuable it is now. These works were valuable before, but now they are a sensation. This is the only case of the military transport and cultural heritage. Art historians have already confirmed the authenticity of the works. Next they will be restored, and later an exhibition is planned. Reported by Nadia Sahurukova for UATV.